And to Benue State, where Governor Samuel Otom has charged his appointees to actively participate in the forthcoming local government election and the PDP ward congresses. Addressing the appointees at the government house in Makadi, the governor, Otom, urged the appointees to go back to their various communities and work in synergy with party leaders to ensure the success of the two exercises. Mayo Akwato reports. The council elections and the ward congresses have been slated to take place simultaneously on the 30th of April this year. To achieve its sources, the governor meets with his appointees at the government house. Yeah, it tasks them not just to participate in the forthcoming local government elections and the People's Democratic Party World Congresses, but also to cooperate with one another during the World Congresses, where three ad hoc delegates are expected to emerge for a successful conduct of so, the exercise. Every one of you must participate in the Congresses that are coming up. The local government election, you must also be around in case of any mischief from anywhere. You should be able to defend it. He explains that the constitution of the party yeah. encourages zoning and consensus, saying that the emergence of the deputy governor That's Ben Nabonu from Bainway South and Titus Uba from Bainway Northeast Senatorial District was done transparently involving all stakeholders from the three zones and will be concluded without any each. The way we meet, and we look at the pluses and minuses and agree on a particular person that we will work with out of these two. That will be the decision of the party, and I expect that all those who are my appointees to work towards achieving that. Governor Tom appeals to those who would emerge as delegates and other members of the party, including aspirants who may have lost out, to accept the decision of the party regarding the selection of candidates and work together to ensure that the party comes out victorious in the next year's election. Mayowa Okwato, TVC News, Makodi.